guys, JL Ghost here, back with another episode of Mass Effect 2. And in the last episode, you know, we kind of did a couple of things and then made it to the colony here, which is under attack. So we got to go ahead and help these guys out. But before we do, do have to give a little YouTube message. You guys know what it is. If you like content, be sure to subscribe, hit that like button. If you want to see more from the channel, hit that bell icon to get notifications from us. And, now that we got that out of the way, let's get it started. Use detection make us invisible to swarms. In theory. In theory? Experimental technology. Only test is contact with seeker swarms. Have to test them in person. Should be exciting. I guess it's a good thing you're here then, bro. No, I don't like that he's saying in theory. Is that the swarm? Maybe. What are we looking for here? Hey, where everyone be, bro? Oh, I see a couple dudes. Oh, yeah, it's like a... I don't even know what the hell that is, bro. It's just like a bug man, I guess. Yeah, it's totally just a bug man, dude. Oh shit, we're getting lit up though. Bugman getting us. Yeah, I ain't got no shield. This Bugman getting up at us. Was that all of them? Where's the other one? Oh shit, they're over there. Oh yo, is he healing us, bro? I mean, he is like a doctor, eh? Okay, good, we got him. That was close. Is there still another one, bro? Where'd the other one at? Oh, he's right there, damn. I honestly didn't even see him. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything good up in these crates, so... Ooh, a data pad. We got time to hack it. Okay, um... That one. Shit, where does the last one be? Oh, there. Nice. What we get from it? Oh, just some money? I mean, that ain't bad, but... That'd be something kind of cool. Oh, shit. Yeah, that must be their swarm, bro. Well, it seems like scientists main shit's working. Collector ship disrupting communications. We're on our own now. That's great. I mean, we'll be fine, but... Okay, it looks like they kidnapped a bunch of people. It's looking pretty empty as of right now. I know they froze them and stuff, so... Oh, shit, bro. They converted some of them already, too. Look at that. Those are husks, and you know those are... Or, I guess, used to be human. They're not human anymore. Hi, bro. Is that all of them? Okay, that seems to be all of them. Yeah, see? That's what I was saying. Then your elusive man was right. Collectors must work for the Reapers. Yeah, that ain't good. I mean, it's good he was right, but it's bad situation. More data. Okay, cool. We didn't even have to do anything for that one. Okay, so where are we supposed to go, though? Maybe up here. Oh, if we can go up the stairs, that is. We got some ammo. It's always good to have. So, yeah, that's their ship. Ooh, there's a dead one. Ooh. Nice. It's looking like this is where it wants us to go. Oh yeah, we're gonna check them out. This one of the colonists. No, no husk creation spikes. Collectors brought husks with them, taking colonists alive. Some other purpose. To turn them into that, bro. But they do look a little different. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced, evolved. They still die when you shoot them. That's true, but let's go save the colonists. The collectors aren't 
getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we gotta save who we can save at this point. Oh, bro. Must have happened quickly. Damn. Well, you know them other dudes are still around because they got all them pods. Bro, I'm always ready to fight at this point, honestly. Oh, shit, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. Where did that, oh, is that really the last one? That worked good then. Oh no, there's another one up there. Alright, there we go. Nice. So. Shit. We're going up here. There's a safe. We could get that. But. It looks like they took them out, so I guess we can, we can go ahead and, you know, bypass this real fast. I don't think it'll take long at all. And we're done. Cool, got a bit more money. Doesn't seem like there's any, like, data on them, though, which is unfortunate. Okay, let's go up in here. See what's going on. Just more of these, like, just more of these gross looking caterpillar looking dudes, I guess. Ooh, there's explosives. Okay, we'll be fine. Looks like we gotta go farther up. Ooh. Yo, is that the dude? Fully aware. Trapped in stasis. Fascinating. They've been like this a long time. Or isn't that our dude? Maybe not. Oh yeah, there's another one. Well, it's good we interrupted him. So we saved at least a couple people. If nothing else. What did I see? Ooh, a computer. We're gonna hack that for sure. And, okay, there's the first one. Where's that second one? I think it's that one. And, boom, done. Nice. Oh, just some money. Better than nothing, though. Okay, where... Where are we supposed to be going right now, my guy? I thought we were supposed to go up here. I mean, it was cool to see these guys all frozen. That ain't <laughs> that ain't even where we're supposed to be going. Ooh. Yo, is this our new heavy weapon? Oh shit, that's not that's not what I wanted. It is, bro. Okay, I'm gonna try it out. So I'm curious about it. Yeah, where the hell am I supposed to go? I guess through here. Look, there's another dude. There's a bunch of these guys frozen up. Oh, shit, there's more of these guys. Okay, we're gonna try out their beam on them. Oh, it's that spider guy, bro. Oh, he's, like, taking, taking them over. Look at the... That might be a problem. Oh, yeah, there he is. Oh, yo, it swapped our weapons, bro. What the hell? I know I have that particle beam equipped. Alright. And here we go. We'll be good. Your form is fragile, bro. Don't eat. Yo, we just lasered them all. This shit's pretty good, honestly. Look at that. Just zapping them. Right, where are you guys at? Oh, there he is. Oh, bro, there you are. Nice, we got him. Honestly, this shit is reminding me of, like... Damn, I can't remember... The name of the game. Oh, shit, we died. 
die, dude. Using that weapon really reminds me of a. Uh, I think it was like Battle Bears or some shit. It was an old iPhone game. And it's like. Almost like a Call of Duty Zombies, but you're. You know, like a bear fighting, like. I guess. I don't know, Huggies? Huggy Bears? Like them Care Bears, bro? They're like infecting everyone. That shit's pretty dope. But yeah, you get this laser in that shit, and this shit just really, like, heavily reminds me of that shit. But yeah, and, you know, without anything else, we're gonna go ahead and zap these guys out. Okay, so they want our body, bro. That ain't good. Alright, so I want to go in that door. So obviously... They're trying to stop us from getting inside, right? So if we can get inside, that's going to be real good. Ooh, and more ammo. Hell yeah. Okay, yeah, we're, we're definitely better off in here. Okay, I know that guy's around. Oh, there he is. Alright, bro, eat laser. Okay, do we get him? Looks like we got them. Is that all of them? It's most of them. That might be all of them in this area. Oh yeah, dude, for sure. We just gotta hack the door. Let's get this shit open. Get the hell out of here. Get away from Evil Man. Alright. Doing all right. And there's the last one. Okay, cool. We're gonna swap our weapon back. We probably don't need the laser at the moment. At least we made it to like maybe an armory or something. Company. Oh, someone's here. Oh, shit, it's just a dude. Okay. You're, you're human. What are you doing out here? You leave them right here. They knew you were here. You had to hear them try to get in. Seems like it's hard to hide from the collectors. Those things are collectors? You mean, they're real? I thought they were just made up, you know, propaganda to keep us in Alliance space. No. Oh. They got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. Tell me about the attack. I need to know what I'm up against. Tell me everything you remember. We lost our comm signals a few hours ago. I came down to check on the main grid. Then I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of bugs. Everyone they touched just froze. I, I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed that Commander Alenko here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. Tell me about Alenko. Tell me more about this Alliance rep. Commander Alenko? Heard he was some kind of hero or something. That made nothing to me, though. But rather he'd stayed back in council space. Why was he here? Any idea what he was doing on Horizon? Supposed to be helping us get the defense towers up and running. I got the feeling he was here for something else. Spying on us, maybe. Okay, so this guy's definitely paranoid. Tell me about the towers. Tell me about the colony defense towers. A gift from the Alliance. High-powered guardian lasers. Supposed to keep hostile ships from landing near the colony. Had to build a massive underground generator just to give it enough juice. Only we couldn't get the targeting systems online. So the Alliance gave us a giant gun that couldn't shoot straight. Stupid sons of bitches. So is that why you don't like them? Why do you think this is the Alliance's fault? We're just a small colony. Nobody bothered us before we started building those damn defense towers and drew attention to ourselves. I left Council Space to get away from the Alliance. Nothing good ever comes from getting mixed up with them. It's not their fault. The Collectors are targeting remote colonies. The Alliance was trying to help. I don't need their help. Too many strings attached. That rep said he was just here to get the towers online. But mark my word, there's more to it. Yeah, you can think that all you want, but we could use those towers right about now. If you have defenses, we can use them against the collector ship. 
You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. Shouldn't be hard to figure out. Just need the location. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. Well, wait here. It's probably just better if you stay out of the way. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. Good luck. I think you're gonna need it. Well, it's a good thing we brought the doctor dude with us. Okay. Ooh. I'll take that palladium. And... Med kit. Nice. Ooh, a wall safe too, bro. Hell yeah. And now the real question, right? Do we want to change any of our guns? Pretty happy with that. I think we're good on everything. This particle beam seems to be really good, honestly. I am tempted to try out the arc projector. As well as, like, the missile launcher and the avalanche. But, like... Particle beam's working pretty good for us, so... I think we're gonna stick with it. Oh, damn. Okay, so we just gotta... Head to the far side of the colony... Calibrate the guns. Shoot the ship. Should be pretty straightforward, right? Oh, shit. We got enemies up in here. Oh, shit. And we got that dude again. Oh, yo. That ain't good. Okay, I'll take that. Uh, you guys need to hop off. Oh, they're going to focus on us. That's nice. Oh shit, yeah, we're getting hit. Where you guys is? Oh, there you are. Okay, we almost got the one. This hurts you. What? Oh shit, did he just throw a grenade at us? Oh hell no, he's right there. That ain't good. Alright, let's go. Let's get him. And we got him. Nice. Damn, bro, he's really trying to kill us. It's kind of weird he wants to keep us alive at the same time. What the hell is that? But what I what is that? What is, what is that, bro? I don't know what the hell that is. I'll take that guy out, though. Alright, bro, go down. There we go. Got him. What What is you? Ah, uh, whatever it is, it does damage. Scion. What the hell is a Scion? I mean, I know it's a car, but... That man's ain't no car. Hey, look at it, bro. What the hell is that? Damn. That is like a mutant. It's a mutant... Robot alien, dude. So that's something. Oh, we can check this dead one out. Ooh, nice. Biotic damage. I don't think we use biotic, but, you know. Colonists loaded onto ship. Collectors nearly finished here. Need to hurry. Yeah, they gathered them all up. We do need to hurry, but we're gonna see what's up here first. Just because I don't want to miss nothing. Damn. Ooh. What is you? Oh, that's money. Money's always good. But I'm pretty sure resources are good as well. Because. Don't think you can buy them in this game. But. Could be wrong. Damn. I seen something for us to access. I swear. Oh, well, maybe it was the door I was seeing. Okay, so hack this and... let see where we gotta go, right? Shouldn't have to go too far away. But... Maybe we do. I mean, this seems like it's other end of the colony. Is this where we're about to have to calibrate? I mean, there's the gun, so... 
Seems like we're about to calibrate it here. Oh, shit. They got a bunch more of these mutants, bro. That ain't good. And I mean, like, a bunch of them. Oh, they got the humans, too. Oh, damn. Is that? Dude, honestly, like, one shots our shields. So we gotta take them out. Good thing our guys are, like, focus firing on the little dudes. That's a good thing. Okay, is that the first dude down? Oh, hell no. Oh, bro, we're about to die. Oh, hell no. Yeah, we for real about to die. Like, I'm about to die. Okay, good. We got one of the big guys taken out. Now, we still got a bunch of zombies. Essentially, coming after us. Like, they're not actually zombies, but they might as well be. Oh, shit, that ain't good. See, dude, that guy's shit is the worst. Okay, we need to swap weapons anyway. I'm just gonna laser his ass. Alright, bro, you need to... You need to chill. You need to knock it off. Damn, he takes damage, bro. Like, he for real takes damage. Okay, what gun do we even want? I guess we're gonna go with the shotgun. Okay, we gotta go to the tower. Where's the tower? I mean, we're going to check out this first, because I need all the ammo I can get. Nice, got some heavy weapons ammo. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Ooh, and a computer to hack. We should be able to do this. Okay, where's the second one? No, that ain't it. Oh, here it is. And where's number three? Uh, I'm not seeing it. Oh, there it is. Cool. That was pretty close, but we got it. Normandy, do you copy? Joker here. Signals weak, Commander. Oh, that's what we were supposed to. We need help with the towers. Edie, can you get the colony's defense towers online? Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. The collectors will try to stop it. Good. Anything else? Got any other helpful tips? Just one. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. That's great. Okay, I'm gonna see what's in here too. Oh, we can't even go in there. Shit. Well, that might be wrong. Oh, yo, we're using a shotgun. Shit. We're, we're, we're big issue right now. Uh-oh, we're, we're on fire, bro. We're, we're, we're for real gonna die. Alright, yo, is our... Okay, we're back to full ammo. That's good. Oh, damn, bro, where you at? Bro, I am working on it. You need to speed up, though. I mean, I guess this is a good reason to have an AI. Because, like, obviously they're going to be better than you at, like, fixing bugs and software and shit. Way more efficient at that. Okay, looks like we got them all. Doubtful that enemy has withdrawn. Reinforcements likely. I'm still kind of bummed we haven't seen our dude yet. So does that mean he got kidnapped? And he's on their ship. So are we going to have to go on the ship and rescue these dudes? Oh, 40%, bro. Yeah, they said, oh shit, they're powering up the gun. They knew exactly what we were up to. Well, it's a good thing we got the whole crew here. Oh, shit. Damn, they're putting in work on these guys. I'm happy we brought this crew now. Oh, shit. Damn, he's doing damage to us, bro. I right, just go down, bro. Okay, we got him. But we're also getting lit up pretty hard. Okay, 60... 
Okay, we're at 60 at least. That's good. So, is she just gonna, like, bypass it by using the ship there will be more. as a proxy targeting system? Is that how she's bypassing the bug? Oh, shit, what the hell is that? Bruh. What is that? We're, we're using this on that. Yeah, we do need that shit online, bro. Uh, yeah, I don't know what the hell that thing is, but... Big problem. I just go go down, bro. Okay, well, take out the ship then, please. If you don't mind. We're gonna have to end this guy. Oh, bro. You got just the thing to help? That would be great. Oh, shit. Ran out of ammo. Good. Very good. Very, very good. Alright. Gonna take him down. Okay, good, we got him. I don't know what the hell that is, but we got it. Yeah, we're, we're doing work on the ship. Or is she just like accounting for the bug to get the cannon to work. I don't even know what she's doing. Looks like she took out the ship. Or at least got him to leave. Not necessarily took it out. Was seen enough damage to get it to, you know, take off. No! Don't let him get away! What'd you expect me to do? That ship is huge. Exactly how are we supposed to catch it? Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something. Well, bruh, I don't know what you want me to do. Blame them, not me. I did my best. You just hit in your damn bunker. Show respect. If it wasn't for Shepard, you'd all be on that ship. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard. Oh, hey, he is alive, bro. First human specter, savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a legend, Delan. And a ghost. All the good people we lost and you get left behind. Figures. Screw this. I'm done with you Alliance types. I thought you were dead, Commander. We all did. Well, I mean, I was, technically. A reunion has to wait. Cerberus brought me back to stop attacks like this. You're with Cerberus now. I can't believe the reports were right. Reports? You already knew? Alliance Intel thought Cerberus might be behind the missing human colonies. I got a tip this colony might be the next one to get hit. Anderson stonewalled me. There were rumors that you weren't dead, that you were working for the enemy. But uh, wait, how is Cerberus the enemy? Our colonies are disappearing. The Alliance turned its back on them. Cerberus is the only group willing to do something about it. You can't really believe that. We both know what Cerberus is like, what they're capable of. I that, that's true. Cerberus that is true. Around, but I never expected anything like this. You've turned your back on everything we stood for. Bro, look, I'm not a traitor. Caden, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I want to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. They could be using the threat of a Reaper to manipulate you. What if they're behind it? What if they're working with the Collectors? Mm, too hung up on Cerberus, ignoring the real threat. Yeah, bro, he's right. You're too emotional. You're letting how you feel about their history get in the way of facts. Maybe. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe you're the one who's not thinking straight. You've changed. But I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. Always will be. I've got to report back to the Citadel. They can decide if they believe your story or not. Bruh, you sure? I mean, like, I got 
pretty much everyone else from the OG crew. You sure you don't want to join up? I could use someone like you in my crew, Caden. It'll be just like old times. No, it won't. I'll never work for Cerberus. Goodbye, Shepard. Fair enough. And be careful. But yeah, nah, he's too hung up on Cerberus. I don't give a shit about Cerberus. I've had enough of this colony. Like, bro, as far as I'm concerned, Cerberus bunch of dicks. I mean, they brought us back to life, yeah, but they do some fucked up science experiments. And, like, honestly, I don't trust Crazy Man that we see in the chair right here. I don't know what he's up to. Like, look at him, bro. He's plotting something. He's the Musk of Mass Effect. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully the Collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. Bruh, how was that good? I didn't even save everyone. It's not a victory. We interrupted the Collectors, but they still abducted half the colony. That's better than an entire colony, and more than we've accomplished since the abductions began. The Collectors will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. What do you mean, another way? Caden said the Alliance got a tip about me and Cerberus. Was that you? I may have let it slip that you were alive, and with Cerberus. You risked the lives of my friend, my crew, and that entire colony, just to lure the Collectors there? A calculated risk. I suspected the Collectors were looking for you, or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. I told you I wouldn't sit and wait while the Reapers and Collectors gather strength. Besides, they would have hit another colony eventually, and without a way to predict which one, they would have abducted everyone. Bruh, you're a dick. Okay, we need a plan. What's our next but you are a dick. See, I knew he was plotting, bro. They'll be more cautious with their ground operations. So we need another opening. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you put your past relationships behind you? Bruh, that's off limits. None of your damn business. If it affects the mission, better you should leave it behind. Shepard, once you find a way through the Omega-4 relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. Well, we're good, I guess. Pep talk, but we'll be fine. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. And be careful, Shepard. The Collectors will be watching you. Okay, he gave us three more dudes. Nice. I guess we're really going to do it. Hit the Omega-4 relay. Take the fight to the Collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though... Makes you think. What do you mean? Something on your mind? No, just... There's a good chance we're not coming back, even if we get it done. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? Damn, I wonder what his unfinished business is. Okay, so we got a couple more things to do. Okay, so that's... Okay, yeah, we got three more people. Okay, bro, you got anything new to tell us? Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Perhaps later. Trying to determine how scale itch got onto Normandy. Sexually transmitted disease only carried by Varen. Implications unpleasant. Anything else? No, I'm good. You work. We'll be here if you need that me. was enough for me, bro. Oh, what about this dude? He was like implicating. He wanted to talk. Commander, sorry, I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. What is it, bro? Always have time for my crew. What is it? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it turns out to be a goose chase. Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. Okay, what's up? I'm listening. 
My private log got an update about the Hugo Gerns back, the ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week, reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing ten years ago. I hadn't talked to my father for three years before that. I buried everything but a body. Now, I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. Who you want to check it out? You'd like us to go take a look at the wreck? See if it's legit? If the coordinates aren't too far out of our way, I could at least verify the wreck. Who knows, maybe there is actually someone out there. I want to also mention that I don't make a habit of looking for random SOS signals. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. Okay, yeah, we could do that. I think we can spare the time. Pass the coordinates to Joker. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect more than dusty old bones, but it'll be good to close the record. Cool. So, let's see. I think we have a mission, dude, for almost every person. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so yeah, Jacob's got to get... Jacob's got a mission. Okay, so we got to go talk to Miranda. She wants to talk to us. Something about Shadow Broker. Oh, we might be able to find Liara. Okay, and then we're getting... Three people. One of them's Tally, so we already know one of them. And that's like our main mission. Okay, so we want to talk to Miranda and do her mission. Because, like, right? Yeah, we got a mission for Miranda, Jacob, Zaid, and Kasumi. So that's four. And I'm thinking we got, like, I don't know, bro. How many people we even got? Is there even a way for me to see? I guess not while we're in here, but I think we got like five or six. So maybe we need two more. Yeah, we received a new message at your private terminal. Uh, that's good to know. Cause okay, so we don't have one for grunt. And we don't have one for Garrus. Thank you, Commander. Rupert put the new supplies to good use. And I think that's it. Because we have one for... Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure everyone else. Oh, no, we don't have one for Jack. Shepard, need me for something? Just want to talk. Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibration. Okay, so he's still doing his thing. I'll be here if you need me. But I'm pretty sure we talk to each one and get a mission from everyone. So it's seeming at this point we're just getting the mission from, like, the Cerberus people. So that's going to be Miranda and Jacob. So what does she want? Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't like discussing personal matters, but this is important. What's wrong? What's going on? You remember what I told you about father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe, until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. Only not anymore. So you think your father has tracked her down? Precisely, Commander. My sources indicate he knows that she's on Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. I could help. What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nos Astra docking bay. Yeah, we could do that because we already got to go to Ilium or one of these dudes, right? One of these people I swear we got to go to Ilium for. Okay, so we've done all that. 
we can go ahead and talk to Jack. See if they got a mission for us. And I 100% know we don't have one for Grunt. Because, like... Because they, like, confront you and say that he's acting strangely when he, you get the mission for him. So it's like a little bit. Do we get the mission for you? Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. What are you up to? Still checking out your ship. Wouldn't mind putting her through her paces when you're not around. Maybe later. I doubt Joker would appreciate that. At least not while we're working. Relax. Joyriding doesn't have the thrill it used to. Besides, if I wanted it, I'd take it. That's so. I've been around. Ran with gangs, wiped out some gangs, joined a cult. Kept the haircut. I learned how to survive and not be a victim. Ooh, yo, tell me about the cult. Imagine you in a cult. That usually involves a lot of rules. I was looking for answers. Drugs and sex and going to a better place. A better place, right. It was all about money. They wanted to take a colony, shake the suckers down to fund their spread, and guess who was their ace in the hole? They were just like the rest. Didn't give one shit about me. What happened to them? What did you do when you found out? What do you think? Killed them. So you don't trust anyone. You must have met some good people, too. Everybody wants something, and because of that, everything is fair game. Murder, assault, kidnapping, drugs, stealing, arson. Done it all, and that's the boring shit. Pirates, Damn, that's a lot of craft, shit. Destruction of a space station, and vandalism. Yo, theft of military craft and destruction of a space station. God damn, you you don't regret none of it. You ever wonder if you could have done things differently? No. Shouldn't you? There's no reason I should be alive, but I am. You know why? Instinct. It's worked for me so far, and I'm not going to change. Let's drop it, okay? Get back to whatever it is you think we can do. Oh, fair enough. So I don't think we got a mission for her yet, then. So... I think that's everything that we got to catch up on. I mean, we talked to these guys. These guys need anything. The new armor reinforcements really threw off the gravimetric profile. But engines are good. You guys good? Um... I guess I can't talk to him anymore. I didn't know if they needed any more parts or anything. And now we're gonna feed our fish as well. Just cause, you know, if I forget to do that, they're kinda gonna die. And while we're in here... We can check our private terminal if I can find it. Oh, yeah, there it is. Oh, that's a TV, bro. Thank you for your time. I'll keep this brief. We have a deep cover operative out in Batarian space. Name's Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson recently reported that she found evidence of an imminent Reaper invasion. That ain't good. So why call me? Just this morning I received word that the Batarians arrested her. They're holding her in a secret prison outpost on terrorism charges. I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. Yeah, bro, I could do that. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground at a Batarian outpost in Aratat. I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it. That's not good, though. So, shit. What is that? Oh, that's Edie. All right, bro. We're gonna go back to the main area, and let's we talk to you too. I saw the reports on Horizon, Commander. What you did was amazing. The report mentioned that Caden Alenko was there. How did that go? Uh, 
I guess you could say it went well. It was good to see you. That's good to hear. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? How's the crew? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? Let's chat. Do you have a moment to talk? I always have time for you, Commander. Okay. Okay, it's nothing new. I better go. Okay. Maybe we'll talk later. Alright, what what messages we got, bro? What the hell is this? Okay, so I guess we let someone out of prison. And just telling us about the shadow broker. Okay, cool. Okay, yeah, here's where we can see our team. Okay, so we have a mission for him. Her. Him. And her. So we still need... Like seven. We're gonna need seven more missions. Maybe six. Because I think one of them does, like, has a mission, but it's like how you unlock them or some shit. But. Okay, so you got Morden and Garrus. Okay, yeah, so. Alright, and let's look at the map here real fast. See. Like, how many different spots we gotta go to. Okay, cool. There's the thing. Okay, bro. Okay, there's Omega. There's Project Overlord. There's where we go to help Jacob. This is Ilium. Where we recruit everybody. And help Miranda. Plus give Liara intel. And this one's to help Zaid and Firewalker. Honestly, bro. Okay, we're gonna go to Ilium real fast. I think that's gonna be the move. I mean, we certainly have a lot of shit to do there. And where is Ilium? Yeah, literally everything's on Ilium. So is this just like a, I guess, open world area? Almost like the Citadel, maybe. And we'll just go ahead and we'll run her and... Honestly... Bro, I'll run Doctor, dude. Okay, we'll give it into... I guess Warp. And then his will do cryoblast. Oh. Nice. So now we should be good. Damn, this shit looks pretty dope. It's like a full city. Oh, damn, they got mech, like, security dudes. Welcome to Nosastra, Commander Shepard. We've been instructed to waive all docking and administration fees for your visit. Nice. My name is Karina. If you need information about the area, it would be my pleasure to assist you. Why do I get the free pass? Who instructed you to waive the fees? The order came from Liara Tassoni, who paid nice. all the fees on your behalf. She also asked that I direct you to speak with her at your convenience. She's near the trading floor. Okay, that's good to know. What are your guys' attractions? Do you have any recommendations about what to do on Nos Astra? Our trading center is directly ahead. You'll find restaurants and shops nearby as well. I suggest you browse our shopping kiosks. You can find things on Nos Astra that you can't find anywhere else in the galaxy. That'll be good. Can we tell me about uh, the place, I guess? What can you tell me about Nos Astra? It's an exciting city. We see a lot of new cultures and goods because of our proximity to the Terminus systems. At the same time, Ilium is still in a sorry world. You should be as safe here as you would be on the Citadel. For your own safety, however, I recommend against signing anything. I can't sign anything. 
What's so dangerous about signing something? Ilium is a free trade world commander. Contract term requirements are more relaxed here than on other planets. It's a small price to pay for keeping our competitive edge in goods from the Terminus systems. Okay, so like... You could be signed up for like some shit you don't want to be signed up for, is what they're saying. What are you tell me about trading? You mentioned trading. What gets traded on Ilium? Anything you can imagine, Commander. Ilium is a wonderful world for those who can afford it. In order to remain competitive as a Terminus Systems port, we've relaxed many of the standards you'd find on other Asari worlds. Most drugs are legal, provided they are labeled properly. You can buy almost any weapon or technology. You can even buy indentured servants. Damn, okay, so... That's why she's telling us not to sign anything. So there is slavery. That is pretty messed up. I can't believe an Asari world would allow slavery. We try to avoid calling it slavery. All indentured servants on Ilium have voluntarily agreed to a term of service. Most choose indentured service as a means to pay off debt or avoid imprisonment. A contract holder is responsible for the well-being of her servants, and a servant's duties are agreed upon before the contract is signed. Yeah, see, that's why she said don't sign nothing. Okay, I see what's going on here. What are you telling me about Liara? You said Liara was here? What's she doing? Liara is one of Nosastra's most respected information brokers. Nosastra is based upon trade. Information is valuable currency, and Liara has done quite well. As I said, you'll find her near the trading floor. She was looking forward to seeing you. That's good, and I'm looking for someone. I'm on a mission. Can you help me find someone? I can help you find major entertainment centers or stores, but I'm afraid I can't point you to individual people. Fair Liara enough. Is excellent at that type of work, however. Oh, so okay, cool. She can help you. Nice. Thank you. Again, welcome to our city, Commander. Please enjoy your stay. Customs records indicated just a car named Samara is visiting this port, Shepard. Your former teammate, Liara Tassoni, may have more information. Her office overlooks the trading floor. You may wish to speak with her regarding the whereabouts of Thane Krios, the assassin on your dossier, as well. Also, I have a message for Miss Lawson. Lantea has reserved a room at Eternity and will be waiting. Thank you, Edie. Man, we didn't even need to talk to that lady. Edie figured everything out just for us. But, anyway, though, yeah, now that we've arrived on Ilium and have learned a couple things, I'm going to go ahead and call it for this episode. Should have another one up next week. And then tomorrow we're going to have some more High on Life playthrough up. So, that sounds like something you want to check out. Go ahead and tune on in then. And, just remember, if you like content, be sure to subscribe. Hit that like button. If you want to see more from the channel, hit that bell icon to get notifications from us. And, now that we got that out of the way, I'll see you guys later. Peace.